Adding a bibliography to your PowerPoint. After your presentation slides, go ahead and add a new slide and call it Bibliography. The Chicago Manual of Style indicates that the title Bibliography should be centered. So go ahead and highlight that title and then click on the center button in the ribbon to center it on the page. Now since you've already created your bibliography in a Word document, the hard work's done for you. Just go over to your Word document and copy all of your bibliography entries. Paste them into your PowerPoint and you'll see that, that most of it's done, but there's a few things we need to clean up before it's formatted really correctly. Highlight all of your entries and the first thing we want to do is go up to Paragraph and click on the Bullets button to take away those um, bullets next to each entry. The second thing we want to take care of is that hanging indent. You remember we put that in our Word document. We need to reapply it because it disappeared when we moved this over to PowerPoint. To do that, we want to go up to Paragraph and click on that arrow to expand the box. Under Indentation, pull down the box next to Special and click on Hanging. That'll give us a hanging indent. If I hit OK at this point, you'll notice that the hanging indent doesn't appear. That's because there's one more setting we need to adjust. If you go back to Paragraph and pull down that arrow button, um, you'll see the same dialog box. Indentation before text, I want to change this to 0.5 and then hit OK. Then your hanging indent will show up and it's formatted um, the way it should be.